People of the Purple Butterfly here, otherwise known as People of Seven on Twitter and YouTube, people of elsewhere or on the internet. My blog is located at purplebutterfly-people.blogspot.com. My soaps, Purple Butterfly Soaps, can be located at people.etsy.com. And my t-shirt designs, purplebutterfly-people.tmail.com. And a while back, I told you about my penguin pod. And then I promptly misplaced it and ended up buying another penguin pod. Well, the original penguin pod... The one that I painted pink and the one that I marbled and the one that I put a purple glitter, uh, pink glitter all over, it's been found. It was in my inventory box and when I went to play, um, fulfill an order that came in for some um, cherry lavender soap, when I went to take it out the box, it showed up. So that's my original penguin. It used to be white. And I put the glitter pink um, gel paint all over it. This is um, gel nail polish. And basically, it's like you paint it, you stick it under the lamp for 10, 20 seconds, and new look. And this is the penguin pod that I replaced it with when that got lost. And as you notice, there's a clear window there. This was the special edition. So now, because both of them are here, I could tell you the differences between the two. First of all, the original, that's made of some kind of metal. And it's always warm to the touch. This, listen to that. That's plastic. Okay, this, everything's the same on the inside. And there's one thing I definitely noticed. This one is the same too, but there's, I don't know if it shows up on the camera or not, but there's a crack right there because it's plastic. And you spend a lot of times like pushing it, to, you know, back together because it keeps trying to separate. And yeah, see like that? I have to push it together. This never does that. It's in there and it stays in there. There's no separation. See, you could probably even look right at it and tell. This one's also slightly more streamlined. It's not bulky or anything like that. Whereas this one, I can't say that about. It's slightly bigger. This one tends to overheat. This is the special edition, which means special edition, the upgrade, blah, blah, blah. When you upgrade something, it's supposed to be better than the predecessor, and that's not the case. So if I could go and get another um, original penguin pot, I would. And then have somebody maybe cut a hole in there because that was the only thing that was different was the fact that there's a view um, a view viewfinder basically so that way you can see when your juice is um, almost out and with the darker colors you couldn't do that anyway because well it's really dark so a lot of times you either had to hold it up like this or go like this or just pop it out and take a look. Or wait till you get that dry burnt feeling and you know. So what I was doing was I was taking the um, pink for the special edition and putting it in my original. And because I painted it pink, it kind of went, kind of looked like it went that way anyway. So, and I can see without needing the, uh, okay, like with this one, you had that view hole. To make sure you um, didn't run out of juice or whatever, that's fine. I can literally look like this. But with the original, I just got the lighter color pot and stuck it in there. And I can see the level of the juice without having to do anything. I mean, this is filled up, but still you can see the bubble clearly. So, that's my comparison of the two. And now that I got my original back, I'm going to just use the original and use the um, Penguin Pie Special Edition as a backup. This one's got brand new um, 
vapor in there and I just charged it. So this one's going to go in the charger. So that way they are both at the ready. Now the one thing that I can say both of them, the original and the special edition both have a pass through. So if you're running low on power you just literally plug it up and vape on while you get it on the charger. But this has been in my purse for the better part of three or four hours so it kind of needs to be on the charger without having to worry about if I'm going to vape while I'm charging it. Which is why I got a second one. I could figure well, that one's charging. This one's on the go, so forth, so on. Then I can just switch them out. And in a pinch, hey, there's a charger in the car, so I can just go ahead and do that. And then that's when this one got, you know, it got ghost, it got lost. I'm assuming it got jealous because it had been replaced and decided, huh, well, I show you, I'll just disappear. Which it did for nearly a year. And I've been using this in all that time, and that's when I noticed... There are several things that's different about it, and somebody said, well, just go ahead and buy another one. Uh, people that say stuff like that, I got it like that. <laughs> <laughs> so in the meantime, this has been People of 7 on Twitter and YouTube, People are Elsewhere on the Internet. My blog is located at purplebutterfly-people.blogspot.com. My soaps, Purple Butterfly Soaps, can be located at people at Etsy.com. And my t-shirt designs, Purple butterfly people. That gmail.com. Y'all stay blessed. Stay tuned. Bye now.